He launches a three. Misses from long range. Out on the way. He shoots from downtown. Misses from the outside. Santo gets the ball. And he misses the shot. Pushes it. Two minutes left on the game clock. On the outside. He gets the shot to fall. Cross court. First personal foul. Too aggressive on defense. He lines up with the foul. Well, you always get your hand reaching in and get in trouble. In the lane. He gets that one to fall. Under one minute remaining on the game clock. Santo gets the pass. He buries it from downtown. Carey receives the pass. Jump shot. No! Grabs the rebound. Out on the right wing. In the lane. He drains the bucket. Stan takes the feed. It looks like they're going to slow the game down by fouling us. The obvious strategy at this point. And yet another stoppage and yet another foul. And why not? They'll throw it in from the side. And the foul will stop the clock momentarily. Inbound from the baseline. Clock management, Gus, that's what it's all about now. Stopping the clock in order to get back into this game. Fox, and that stops the clock again. Opportunity here to put some points up, Gus. Clock stopping. Time out. More CBS Sports coverage of the NCAA right after this.
Welcome back, and we're set to inbound after the timeout. Santos handles the feed. said it so many times survive and advance well one survived and will advance the other one's going home well when you take a close look at this victory it came down to execution we say it all the time but these guys did a terrific job of getting stops at the defensive end and scores at the offensive end that's our coverage of ncaa basketball on cbs sports i'm gus johnson for bill Rapp